What's up guys, Tristan Minton, aka Pager One, back again. Today we got a super dope video. We're checking out my boy Finger Trials. I bought this awesome concrete barrier from him. Absolutely love the insane detail he put into this thing. Had to try and get some clips while it was brand new because I was very excited to rock it. But you know I had to get this thing painted up. Which actually I felt bad painting it because it looks so dang good, but I can't help myself. So, away we go. Painted this whole thing freestyle with some paint markers. I used the Malto. They're like an acrylic based paint marker, kind of have a matte finish. These bright colors really turned out cool though. Really love the neon pink and the neon yellow. But wanted to keep it pretty basic, some letters, some characters. If you aren't out there creating something, I highly suggest you jump in and join the fun. I am sure there's a Michaels or a Hobby Lobby very close to your house. If not, hit up Amazon, get some painting markers. It's the easiest way to paint. No messy cleanup, very satisfying. Markers are pretty opaque, you only have to do one or two coats with some of the light colors, like the yellow. But that's the funnest part. Anybody can do this kind of stuff. And make sure you go get a fingerboard and bring back your childhood. After painting the whole thing, you know I gotta clear coat this thing, so you gotta hit it with some light mists of uh, I use gloss rusto clear coat on this one, I believe. Seems to do pretty good. The gloss always seems to do better than the matte finish or satin or anything else. And then after it finishes drying, you know we gotta sesh this thing. Peep the clips. Appreciate you guys for checking out the video. It means a ton. Let me know what you think. Make sure you follow my boy Finger Trials, and we'll catch you on the next video.